Hi guys, gals, DCT makes here. Doing the PEX thing again. Um, the tools involved this time. Again, I'm not a plumber. This is just, uh, you know, fix stuff. If um, you're going to give it a shot yourself. Um, what I found, um, this great big monster. Um, when you're trying to do, if you're trying to, if you're like making up joints ready and on the bench, great tool. Because... There's one thing about this particular tool is the room you need to use it. Look how far you have to have these open to actually get to the point where you can uh, get the ring in. It's it actually do one. Make sure I'm on, not on my butylene end. Push that in. Really cumbersome. You've got to get it in the joint at the right place. Make sure it doesn't move. Make sure the, the ring doesn't move. Make sure the pipe doesn't move. Make sure the fitting doesn't come out. Blah, 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 blah. And then there you, ah, pop the joint together. Fine. Great joint. The problem is if you're into the house and you have to get that far apart and you've got, I don't know, the one I just did, not last weekend, the weekend before, it got two... Um, Air conditioning run pipes like this. And you got a main feed 220 cable running across the top, a telephone lead, and then the PEX was above that. So there's very little room to actually get that in place. So I started looking around to see if there was better tools. Well, not necessarily better, just easier to use, close quarter stuff. A couple of things I went and purchased. One, this set of uh, cutters, great little cutters. Great cutters, absolutely marvelous. Okay, yeah. Here's one of the different things that I've got. This set, not quite as far open and a little bit smaller using the stainless steel rings. Let's put that on show you this and this one say if you had to take it all apart you can actually use the same tool to actually cut the ring off as put the ring on you just actually change this and I'll show you but on these you would cut this off cut the pipe get your get your fitting back and then redo it with these we'll put it on so uh, there's a lot more visibility put it in the same place you see that you guys A lot less, seems to be a lot less force too. It crimps and there you have a seal. Joint done. Now you can press this little button and actually change the tool over to cut. And you push it back down, lock it back together and then make sure I do it the right way. And actually cut the joint. Oop, wrong way. And then you can get your to get the ring off. And then you can heat this up, pull it off, cut the pipe, blah, blah, blah. Okay, right. That's a little bit more accessible. Now, the best one I've found so far is this guy. Let's make another joint. Put one of the PEX rings on. And look at this guy tight space the tool actually comes apart and then you pull it you pull it back and it opens the jaws and you can get in way tighter spaces like this good visibility on the end of the tool 
if your fat fingers in in a way. Good visibility on the end. Cramp down, or like automatically stops at when the handles come together. You can pull and open. See this? Open it, and then pull, and it opens real wide. But you're not extending that jaw, this handle, excuse jaw, the handle up here. So you're not in the way of a bunch of stuff. So you can get in tighter spaces with this, like I don't know, between in a section of wall between two by fours or whatever. But um, that does a great job too. And it's, it's my eye crimp. Great tool, half, three quarter. You can get, you can buy them just solely with the half here, the three quarter here, or the three eighths there. I, I can't remember if there's an inch one, there might be an inch one. But um, you don't want to drop any of these tools in sand or dirt or anything. Uh, calibration will get messed up. But uh, just a little run on some of the tools. You got any questions, I'll answer them. Again, not a plumber, just home, doing it at home, trying to save some cash. As long as it don't explode, it's good, right? All right. Take it easy, guys. Bye.